South Korea has unveiled its vision for the future of armored warfare with the K-3 main battle tank. As the next generation of South Korea's K-series battle tanks, the K-3 will run on hydrogen fuel cells and incorporate other advanced technology, making it one of the world's most sophisticated tanks. In fact, the K-3 is set to become the world's first hydrogen-powered tank. Currently in development by Hyundai Rotom in partnership with the Korean Agency for Defense Development, the K-3 will mark a significant step towards integrating clean energy technology within military applications. Expected to begin production by 2040, the K-3 is designed to offer South Korea a blend of advanced firepower, enhanced mobility, and reduced detectability, underscoring a growing global trend towards stealth and sustainability in defense technology. So, in this video, let's explore everything we know about South Korea's newest main battle tank. The K-3 tank represents the latest addition to Hyundai Rotom's K-series. Currently, South Korea operates the K-2 Black Panther as its main battle tank, powered by a 1,500-horsepower 12-cylinder diesel engine. In contrast, the K-3 will feature a fully hydrogen-powered platform. Initial models will incorporate both diesel and hydrogen fuel cells, functioning as a hybrid bridge before the planned transition to pure hydrogen propulsion. Beyond environmental benefits, this hydrogen shift will allow for near-silent operation, lower heat emissions, and enhanced stealth capabilities. The minimized acoustic and thermal signatures will improve the K-3's suitability for precision-based missions, aligning with global moves towards sustainable military technology. Currently in its conceptual stage, the K-3's streamlined low-profile design aims to reduce its radar signature and minimize detectability by enemy targeting systems. Hyundai Rotom has integrated advanced automation technology, including a sophisticated autonomous driving system to enable efficient navigation in complex combat environments. The K-3 will also be equipped with a drone deployment capability, allowing it to launch drones directly from the tank to gather real-time battlefield intelligence, reconnaissance, and support functions. In terms of firepower, the K-3 will be outfitted with a next-generation 130mm smoothbore gun, which provides increased firepower compared to the K-2's 120mm gun. This main gun, mounted on an unmanned turret, significantly enhances crew safety by isolating personnel from both ammunition and firing systems. The 130mm gun is also designed for greater range and precision, allowing the K-3 to engage targets up to 5 kilometers away, an advantage over many contemporary MBTs. Supporting this firepower, a remote-controlled weapon station can be fitted with secondary armaments from 12.7mm to 30mm, offering versatility in countering both infantry and lightly armored vehicles. In terms of protection, the K-3 incorporates modular armor technology, which combines steel, ceramic, and composite materials to optimize both protection and weight. This layered armor is engineered to absorb and deflect projectiles, enhancing the tank's resilience against modern anti-tank threats. Additionally, the K-3 will feature a comprehensive defensive suite, including directional infrared countermeasures to disrupt heat-seeking missiles, an active protection system to intercept incoming threats, as well as an anti-drone jamming system. This multifaceted defense approach reflects the latest trends in armored vehicle technology, where layered protection against a range of advanced threats is essential for battlefield survivability. The K-3's crew layout is streamlined, housing only three personnel, a commander, gunner, and driver. This minimized crew setup reflects advancements in autonomous and remote systems within the tank. The crew sits within a reinforced capsule positioned in the front of the tank, maximizing protection against external threats. A significant aspect of the K-3's design is its AI-powered fire control system, which assists in target identification and engagement. 
the AI system is expected to improve target acquisition efficiency and accuracy, which is particularly advantageous during rapid engagement scenarios. This technology, combined with the tank's autoloader, reduces crew fatigue, enhances reaction speed, and increases overall effectiveness on the battlefield. The K-3 tank's development illustrates South Korea's intent to establish technological leadership in sustainable defense systems. The tank is scheduled to enter production as early as 2040, though hybrid prototypes may appear sooner for testing and operational assessments. As the world's first hydrogen-powered MBT, the K-3 could influence global trends, prompting other nations to explore similar applications of green energy in their military forces. By reducing emissions, enhancing mobility, and integrating stealth capabilities, the K-3 positions South Korea at the forefront of next-generation armored technology. So, what do you think about this new tank concept? Let us know in the comments below. And if you found this video interesting and informative, make sure to give it a thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel for the latest defense news and analyses.